Good afternoon, General Counsel. Here we are on Sunday, day two of General Counsel 43 in Oshawa, Ontario. Today we continue the Festival of Faith, which began yesterday, and we also continue to move into the General Council proceedings. This morning began with a beautiful worship service, and will continue throughout the afternoon with listening sessions and business, as well as lots of festival activities. Today, I am thrilled to be joined by our moderator, Reverend Jordan Cantwell. And Jordan has served the church so faithfully over the past three years. And firstly, I just want to say thank you for all that you've done for the church, for your passion, for your deep sense of faith and commitment. It has been a true honor and blessing to uh, see you lead us in this way. So thank you. Thank you. So Jordan, I'm wondering if you could start us off by just telling us a bit about how you're feeling coming into this general council meeting. Okay, well, I'm mostly feeling very excited. I'm a little nervous, but I'm feeling really hopeful about the work that's before us and the exciting decisions that we get to make and the way they're going to challenge and change us as a church. I think this is an incredibly pivotal moment for us, and I'm really thrilled to see what we're going to do. So Jordan, you have served us over the past three years, elected at General Council 42 in Cornerbrook, Newfoundland, and you have traveled all over the country and all over the world representing the United Church over the past three years. You have experienced so much, I can only imagine, um, but I'm wondering if you can give us one highlight of your time as moderator. I know that's a hard question. That's hard, because yeah. there have been a lot of highlights. Um, if I had to just pull one thing out. Uh, I would name the youth events that I've been to. I have been so inspired and, and often they came at a time when I was feeling either exhausted or maybe a little bit low. I'd had some hard visits where my heart was feeling really tender and I would go to a youth forum or some youth event and just feel uplifted, just feel re-energized, so filled with hope for our church, so filled with gratitude for the ministry of the young people in our church and so that's been an ongoing highlight for me. And I'm sure a highlight for them as well to have got to hang out with the moderator. How cool is that? <laughs> so we are going into this full, full week and you will be leading us through the meetings. What are you most excited about for the week ahead and, and maybe also for the future of the church looking ahead? I'm particularly excited about the calls to the church that are coming from the caretakers and what it means for us to embrace these calls and what it will mean for us to live into them. I think that the most profound changes that we are contemplating at this general council come out of that document and out of what it will mean to, to really live into the commitments of the calls to the church. And I am so excited to see where that's going to take us. This is a, a, a moment for us to really become new. Thank you so much, Jordan. Thank you again for serving the church and leading us so faithfully. And thank you for taking the time to chat with me amidst this very busy week. Thanks so much, General Counsel. We'll see you later this afternoon.